Hi, this is Bruce, and I wanted to bring you to a blog that I really like called Eat Smart, Age Smart, and it's written by a woman by the name of Eileen, whose picture you'll see over here on the right side. The major reason I brought you here is for this article, Body Scan of a 250-Pound Woman versus a 120-Pound Woman. On the right here, you see the 120-Pound Woman. Here's Eileen. On the left, here you see the 250-Pound Woman. Let me point out a couple of different things about these two women. First of all, let's look at the muscles. The muscles on this woman who weighs 250 plus is, are much larger. Bigger arms in her arms and shoulders, bigger arms, bigger muscles in her legs and ca you know her thighs and calves. Her bones actually uh, are about the same size, maybe a little bit bigger. Uh, all this is you know pressured by nature from carrying this 250 pounds around so she has a lot of muscle and when she loses weight she'll lose some of this muscle so some of the weight she would lose would be muscle atrophy because she just doesn't have to carry 250 pounds around anymore but the thing I want you to notice is the subcutaneous fat which is much greater here it is on this woman here it is on this woman there is a lot more subcutaneous fat and there's a lot more intra-abdominal fat. Now here you see the liver. Look how huge her liver is. She has fatty infiltration in the liver. This woman's liver is very small. This woman's omentum is quite tiny. You see gas in the intestines here, but what you see is all this intra-abdominal fat and a very, very large stomach, which is what you would expect. This woman is eating more. So I wanted you to see this and be aware of what it looks like under the skin and inside the abdomen. Uh, this fat in the abdomen and the fat around the heart, you can see some up here around the heart, secrete hormones and enzymes that are very detrimental to your health. Th all this weight is very detrimental to these hip joints and to these knee joints. These knee joints are going to wear out much faster than they are on this lady. As a matter of fact, you can see that the joints here are much more open than the joints here. I don't know how old this woman was, but she's been carrying this weight for a while, I would say. Uh, it's not that this woman can't become like this woman. She can over time, but it requires a consistent effort. But without making that effort, this fat is literally going to kill her, and it's going to make her life miserable uh, until she dies. Now, not that she can't be happy, not that she's not a good person. That has, that's not the point here. The point here is, is that she's got to carry this around. It's a lot heavier it's detrimental to her health. Thanks, Eileen, for doing this for us. All right, this is Bruce, over and out.